Welcome to my world of darkness. It is I, the Dark Demon, Mr. Revenge. An AWF Elimination Chamber is in the books, for I walked out your first ever two-time U.S. champ. After I walked in as the natural born driller and in your house rage in the cage against my tag team partner, one half of the tag team champions, Juggalo Gamer, and also then AWF US champ, Jordan Williams, as I delivered the spin kick from hell that took away the US title away from him, and I was crowned the new U.S. Champ in A.W.F. However, after Double A Omega took it away from me with his shenanigans, a title that I don't want, but I need it for the Devil's Plan, the title that I should have never lost. As we walk into that forbidden door, but the forbidden door that we walked into was as Asylum Arena, not as Saudi Arabia, where pertains to that blood money that we refuse to go to. Hell in a Cell was the appropriate way for us to enter into. Where it tends to invoking my rematch clause, the match that I chose, the match that I want to do, and also to dedicate it to the life and career of Bray Wyatt. As the way Omega walked in as the United States Champion, I ended up walking out as the new United States Champion with the spin kick from hell. As I claim the title that I should have never lost in the first place or tends to the way Omega interference in my plans. The devil's plans, I should say. And all was according to plan as well or tends to the devil's plans that I must follow by. And the either if in the current champion, Jordan Williams, all he had to do was to fulfill his part, but instead lost to Nathan Matthews, a rookie in the AWF, to lose the IC title that he should have never lost. He lost to a rookie. A rookie! Jordan Williams, you better invoke that rematch clause to win back the IC title that you sure have never lost. And all I have to do is to go through Double E Omega once again because he invoked in his rematch clause where he thinks that I'm gonna lose to him because I don't have any endurance. I don't know how to go the distance that I don't have the ability to last 60 minutes in an Iron Man match. Double E Omega, you are sadly mistaken. If you think you know me, you don't. Just because you eliminated me from the Labor Day Battle Royal in a matter of minutes and you lasted longer than I did, doesn't mean that I can't go the distance. You just got lucky. Not trying to make any excuse. Not trying to have that type of ego. But then again, I am the ultra ego that the natural born children will never see the light of day ever again. And don't worry, that's coming real soon, very soon. Where it tends to the natural born driller will never ever come back. But in the meantime, I will accept that challenge to meet you, Double A Omega, in a 60 minute Iron Man match. Where we're gonna grab the most falls, but it will be I, Duncan, the most falls. There will be no distractions. There will be no interferences. There will be no shenanigans. None of that whatsoever. It's just you and I. And that I defeat you. And still, your US champ. Hopefully, Jordan Williams. You are the new IC champ. And then, it will be you and I, Jordan Williams. For I the US champ versus the IC champ in a title for title match because the devil's plans 
that I must fulfill. Rotates to unify those belts to create a new belt for the AWF. That would be way more prestigious than the Intercontinental title and the United States title combined. And once that happens, you will come to realize, just like everyone else in the AWF, that that will be the title to be fighting for. For no one will ever take that title from me once it comes to the AWF. For I am Mr. Revenge, and I will have my revenge. For revenge is just too sweet for the Dark Demon. <laughs> Ha 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 